Can I convince you very quickly to tell us the story of the Statue of Liberty, of La, la Bandera y La Señora? Oh. Right? Actually, that picture is what got me started on this, the rest of what you see here. That was a publicity stunt I pulled off in 1957. I was 16 years old when I did that. Uh, there was a group of us, four or five of us, who went to the Statue of Liberty to put the, this flag. This flag has a number of variations, you know. The 26th of July had this, this uh, one design. They had another design, which is a circle, which is the one that's up there. And they had another one, which is the main cross. The cross. It was a, a couple of different types of flags. And uh, the reason we did it, it was, in those years, 1957, there was a lot of things happening in Cuba. And the American press did not reflect anything of what was happening. So there was the idea of floating around with the Cubans in New York, you know, to try to provoke the press. And I get this wacky idea of pulling off this publicity stunt of placing the flag on the statue, taking pictures of it, and I gave it out to all the newspapers in New York and gave it out to all the wire services. And coincidentally, I was very lucky. Lucky in the sense it was the middle of a week. It's one of those days, as I have repeated this a number of times, but one of those days in the press you go to dead day. Nobody important died, nobody important came, nothing important <laughs> happened. So at 16, I make the front page of four of the seven newspapers in New York. The wire services throw all over the country. A big ruckus is formed around the image because the audacity of these Cubans, look at the disrespect for the statue, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Which all fell in my advantage. Gave me the, you might say, the, uh, the privilege of being one of the first people to come in for, I was one of the first to come in from New York to Havana. And uh, I went because of the adventure. I went because I expected it was a short run. But uh, the short run turned out to I'm still there. <laughs> and uh, a lot of people ask me, why did you stay? I said, well, there could be a number of reasons. But one of the things is most important is that I like the weather. Okay, that's about it. Uh, <laughs> Roberto, thank you so thank much. You. Congratulations on your show. Okay, thanks. <laughs> you bet.